there guys, Coaster Chal here, Doncaster born but built for theme parks and welcome to a theme park newsroom update. SeaWorld CEO Mark Swanson has revealed he wants to build hotels. SeaWorld are in the hotel chain, brilliant. And we're going to talk through all the details via a Blue Loop article which I will link in the description down below. I've already seen CoasterBot talk about this on his new theme park news series Dispatch, uh, so please go and watch that. Um, but I thought I'd make my video on this and share my thoughts on this as well. So before we get started with all of that, please like the video if you've loved it. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on this. It's very important you subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. We got on the word on the way to 3,000 subscribers, which means we are 7,000 away nearly from 10,000 subscribers, which I want to, which is what I want to hit in the next year or two. I'm going to make it the next year or two. I think by the end of this year, I'd like to hit 4,000 at max. Because I, I don't think we're going to hit. If we hit 10k by the end of this year, with half of the year still to go, I'd be very amazed. But I'd be happy to hit 4,000 subscribers by the end of this year, which would be amazing anyway. Uh, but please try and get the best you can to 4,000 subscribers. It would really mean a lot to me, guys. Also, check the description down below where not only can you find the link to this article, but you also find social media links and Google Forms link where you can submit your own video ideas. I'll be recording all of them this summer. And for now, guys, let's have a look at exactly what's going on about SeaWorld possibly adding hotels. Very interesting indeed. So via Blue Loop, SeaWorld CEO Mark Swanson has revealed the company is looking to expand by building hotels and adding new rides in an interview with the Orlando Sentinel. Uh, SeaWorld parks across the US do not include hotels, unlike Disney Universal and Legoland Resorts. Now Swanson said this is a strategy now that we've become more recently focused on executing. We have some land parcels and some other things that could make for some exciting hotel locations either on our park property or adjacent to our parks. It's something that we could look at across multiple parks. Nothing specific has been determined, but certainly Orlando would be one that we could consider for the same for our other locations. Now, Swanson was made CEO back on May 5th. He served as interim CEO since April 2020, uh, when Sergio Rivera resigned his post just five months after taking the job. He confirmed the company will also continue to add new rides and attractions. He said, we're going to continue to have new rides and attractions, and our goal is to have something new in the park every every park every year and that is certainly include the parks in Florida these include SeaWorld Aquatica Discovery Cove and Busch Gardens Tampa Bay uh, we have something some things that we can't obviously announce right now but I think people will be excited when they see the future plans for not only our Florida parks but really our parks all across the country uh, the, now SeaWorld previously did have to pay investors 65 million dollars when a federal judge approved a settlement six years after the company was sued for allegedly deceiving stockholders about the negative impact of blackfish on attendance. Now, in terms of uh, the new rise in attractions at SeaWorld, um, on the subject of orcas, Swanson said they'll be with us for some time, so the orcas are going to stay. They're going to focus continuously on animal rescue teams, and they recently released its COVID-19 policy, including removing required temperature checks and allowing vaccinated guests to visit without face coverings. So, the future post-COVID seems very exciting, and trust me, we're going to need Scooby-Doo on this. Scooby-Doo, because this is definitely an exciting mystery. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen, Thrill Six of All Ages. That is talking about the possibility of hotels as well as brand new rides and attractions at SeaWorld Orlando and across the SeaWorld chain. Uh, now, obviously, Mark Swanson's put out this incredible statement sharing, my th sharing their thoughts on this. I'm going to share my thoughts on this. This is great. I think the mystery's been solved. We don't need Scooby-Doo, Fred, Shaggy, Velma and Daphne. This mystery's been solved. And I can guarantee that the perpetrator of this mystery is the king of fun. The king of fun and entertainment. Uh, now, obviously, my thoughts on this is amazing, incredible. It's great to see SeaWorld moving into the hotel resort side of things. Um, we see other parks in the US do this. Six Flags could be looking to do it in the next few years. We did that video, I think, a couple of years ago uh, about a survey coming out about possible Six Flags hotels. Um, I don't know what's happened since that survey was carried out a couple of years ago, but, uh, you know, I'm really glad about that. We know that uh, Legoland's doing this, Disney's done this, or Universal's done this. 
uh, we know all the parks in the in the US have done this, and parks in the UK have done hotels more uh, uh, before SeaWorld, like Alton Towers and Thorpe Park and you know Chessington. So I think that SeaWorld moving into the resort side of things, Dollywood's done the same as well. Um, moving into the resort side of things is great for SeaWorld long term because it can uh, add more guests, it can give them a longer stay, financially it'd be more benefiting for the company. And I think that SeaWorld is definitely moving into the resort side of things, especially with the constant addition of new rides and attractions. Actions. Uh, so I'm very excited about it. I hope you guys are really excited for all this as well. So thank you very much guys for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, my name is Coaster Shell. Keep living the coast life. And I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care guys. Have a SeaWorld-tastic day. Ooh.